Workers and union leaders held a rally and community barbecue today at Jastro Park to celebrate the worker on this Labor Day. 17's Aton Wallace was there and joins us with details. Aton. Those in attendance included farm workers, transportation workers, healthcare specialists, child care providers, and veterans, among others. Their message? Say yes to unions. In celebration of Labor Day, more than 500 people attended this rally and community barbecue at Jastrow Park today. The goal? To show solidarity with workers and unions. We are here to celebrate the working people, unions, coming together as brothers and sisters, making it a better place for us to live in. County employee Juan Contreras was one of those in attendance today. He's been with the Service Employees International Union 521 for five years. Unions have done a lot for the working man. Without unions, there's no middle class. Um, the 1% will just get more and more. And the working class and the poor will get nothing. Supporters argue unions have helped workers earn higher wages, better benefits, and more favorable working conditions. But others say public employee unions are harmful to business and to the economy, with some government leaders arguing wage, benefit, and pension demands from unions are too costly and have been responsible for major cities filing for bankruptcy, including Stockton and San Bernardino. Some argue unions have done more harm than good for the state. What's your response to that? Unions have done good for us. Minimum wage, uh, Social Security, workman's comp, safe work conditions, uh, vacation, holidays. I mean, unions have done so much. If it weren't for the unions, we wouldn't be celebrating what we have today. Ahead on 17 News at 6, we'll hear part of today's exclusive interview with labor leader and activist Dolores Huerta, why she says now more than ever she's urging support for union rights. Hope you can join us then. Eitan Wallace, 17 News. Eitan, thank you.